Thorg could bear it no longer. His family's cruelty had become too much, their arrogance too great. They treated the villagers with a disdain that burned Thorg's soul. The very people he had spared, those he had saved from the storm, were now being crushed under the weight of his family's newfound power. It had to end. Thorg, now calculating and calm, devised a plan. He invited his family to a grand feast, a celebration of their victories. The longhouse was filled with every delicacy imaginable. Roast boar, fresh fish, mead that flowed freely, and fruits from distant lands. His family, drunk on power and wealth, indulged greedily, unaware of the storm brewing outside. Laughter echoed through the hall, their voices loud and boisterous as they reveled in their gluttony. But Thorg was nowhere to be seen. As the night deepened, the sky outside darkened further, thunder rumbling ominously in the distance. Inside, his family remained oblivious, too consumed by their feast to notice the warning signs. It wasn't until the thunder grew louder, more intense, that they paused, looking up from their plates with confusion and unease. But by then, it was too late. Thorg floated above the longhouse, his heart heavy with what he was about to do. Thunder rumbled around him, tears mingling with the rain that began to fall. His family had become a blight, their arrogance poisoning the land he had saved. With a scream of anguish, Thorg unleashed a bolt of lightning so powerful it shattered the night. The longhouse exploded in a flash of light. The feast, the laughter, and the arrogance of his kin turning to ash in an instant. The storm subsided as quickly as it had come, leaving only silence in its wake. Thor, hovering above the ruins, looked down at what he had done, his heart heavy with sorrow. His family was gone, wiped out by his own hand, and though they had deserved it, the weight of his actions bore down on him like never before. Things are really getting interesting, huh? It would mean a lot to us if you liked and shared the video. Click on the profile to see it and more of our engaging stories. And if you haven't already, make sure you've subscribed or followed. Trust us, you don't want to miss out on part six.